Okay, we defeated Anthony Smith. Move up and get some more gold. Accept super fight. What is that? Hmm. All right. Let's accept super fight then. <laughs> let's accept the super fight. Okay. Fight offer. Oh shit! This is gonna be brutal, bro. <laughs> And guess what? He's going to bail out. He's going to bail out at the end. Then I was going to say he's not available for the fight. <laughs> Who could have pictured this, huh? I mean, I always knew you were something special, but but this, this is next level. Only a handful of fighters have become double champs in the UFC. Some very rare company. And Ty, good. All right. At the end of the night, though, remember. It's just a fight. Stay focused on the task at hand. We can worry about finding more trophy space in the morning. <laughs> All right, let's go. Good. That's it. All right, so here we go with this epic fight, one of the biggest fights in UFC history, given what is at stake. Here comes the UFC champion trying to add another title in a second division simultaneously. Doesn't happen every day, folks. We could all witness history here tonight. Well, a lot of people think it's the most significant title in combat sports. No argument from me. Baddest man on the planet, UFC heavyweight champion. There he is in the flesh. What an absolute monster. What a title reign it has been. But a serious challenge in front of him here tonight. When this man became the heavyweight champion, a lot of people thought that this challenger was the one who would wrest the belt away. Now the fight is here. We'll see if we get a new champion or if this man continues one of the greatest heavyweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Overeem is 10 years his senior. He will have a five inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Our round for the undisputed UFC heavyweight Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 18 wins, one loss. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Presenting the challenger international. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 51 wins, 19 losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 260 pounds. Body out of Amsterdam, the Netherlands, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Alistair Marie.
All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Just make it well, I did touch gloves. What the fuck? I'm supposed to touch gloves, man. Why is the, why did the game do that? Why did the game do that? Are you actually supposed to do that? Like actually manually touch gloves on there. All right, let's go. I'll touch your gloves now. Why did you let me touch his gloves? Oh my god, this guy is switching. He's switching. Oh my god. So he's a good boy. Dating to the early days of his UFC career. Here it is. Opportunity of a lifetime. Let's see if he can become a simultaneous two division UFC champion. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the town. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Just unable to quite find that range. Body kick. Really good body kick. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. No, we're not gonna finish. Oh, he needs to start looking. Oh, oh he gets back up, but barely. Look how wobbly he is. Oh, look like it did stun him a little bit. Get up, bitch. Tail the tape, he has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. 30 seconds now to go in the opening round. What beautiful takedown lands. Oh, nice pop there from the crowd as he finally gets the takedown. He stayed committed to the offensive wrestling and now he has his opponent. A sigh of relief from the people watching. Okay, nice. I think we did well in that round. But we need to watch our stamina though. I didn't keep an eye on my stamina. Finally gets it. Now what does he do with the top? Hmm. Man, look at this guy's fucking ears, bro. <laughs> His fucking ears. Replay from that previous round, it was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now, knowing that he's got about as tough a guy. As, if, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round underway. My stamina is still good. Working out of that southpaw stance. He loaded up there on that high kick. Easy. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Time his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Nice. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Left hand punch with the flinch. Right 
right hand upstairs. Oh, and there's a takedown attempt there, DC. I'm no analyst, but that one was pretty telegraphed, not his best effort. Yes, he may as well have sent a text message to his opponent saying, I'm going to shoot the moment the fight starts. Of course, you got the defended. Set up your attacks, young man. Well, that body kick was there earlier. Watch, not watch, there watch, easy. Attempt. Oh, single collar tie here. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from him, and now he is nice. taking control of this second round. Oh, big elbow. Nice. Easy. Oh, vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking these, man. Check these kick four. Stamina, watch my stamina. He has a commitment to kick it tonight and it shows. Liver kick. Oh my god, this guy is a fucking fucking joker. Ooh, head kick lands was hurt. Visibly limping here. Get up, bitch. Motherfucker. Bro. I don't know who on, who got that round, man. My knee is fucking managed distance. I took it too much damage and you got knocked down. Fuck. But I'm trying. This fucker does hit, hit my leg twice. I think we did well. But I don't know, bro. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Look at his ears, bro. Like, fuck it, you know? But this man is just too tough. Some people say oh it's fuck, this must be a glitch or something, because from the back his ears are normal. Alright, so we touch gloves now. His leg is hurt here, you can see him limping a little bit. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Just misses with the jab there. Easy. Nice spinning attack to the body lands for him. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's got to be over very soon. Oh, big knee! Oh, diving punch lands. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Back to the feet. All right. Look at the anger of that nice body kick. Get fucked. Get fucked, bitch. You ain't shit, bro. You ain't shit, bro. You ain't shit, bro. Yeah, that right there is a high level knockout. Man, this was serious, man. I was fucking my stamina. I was looking at my stamina bar like, bro. Oh my god. Ooh. 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 go to sleep bitch well stand and cheer ladies and gentlemen he wins we did it guys we did it we did it for your yes man what the fuck are those <laughs> oh my god at one minute 41 seconds of the third round declaring the winner by No pain, no gain. Well, you can add his name to the list of the 
I got three injuries. Are you serious, man? I've got three injuries from this fight. Some suggested maybe he was biting off more than he can chew. The naysayers are eating crow right now. Oh man, I love this man. I love this. Anyway, guys, that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the fight. <laughs> Subscribe if you're new as well, guys. And like the video as well. And yeah, I'll see you at the next one. Take it easy, guys. And peace.